When home prices rose 40% in a two-year span, many buyers found themselves priced out. Add in rising interest rates and many first-time home buyers just gave up. But starting now, local experts say it's worth revisiting. Kevin Kaplan is the chief operating officer at Long Realty. When asked if it's a buyer's or seller's market, he says neither. Well, I would say it's more of a normal market. Um, meaning that what happened the last two years was not normal <laughs> with the amount of buyers we had and no listings. Right now, there are 2,500 homes for sale in the Tucson area. One year ago, there were only 1,000. In a normal market, Kaplan says there's closer to 4,000. Statistically speaking, we're still in more of a seller's market. And the reason is because even though there's a little less buyers, there's also less listings right now. But instead of new home listings going under contract immediately, it's now taking about 50 days, which is what you'd expect in a normal market. Also, homes are now selling at 95% of the original list price. While all cash buyers made up 31% of recent closings in the Tucson area, Kaplan says those buyers are focused on higher price points. So if somebody was looking in the last year or two and couldn't find anything, they may have a little better chance of finding something now. Tried to buy 2020, but starter homes are like $400,000, so that wasn't going to work. Tired of paying rent, Kat and Kyle Jacobs Crota decided to try home buying again. They recently closed on a four-bedroom, two-bath property near Grant and Alvernon, their ideal location. The price was dropped the day they viewed it, so they offered full price. This felt like the first time in three years that we actually had a chance to make take the plunge and buy a house and so we did it. We've had a little bit of a correction in price but for the last four or five months actually prices have been pretty stable here. So that's something if you're thinking of selling too you should know. Kaplan says some markets are correcting a little harder, meaning home prices are dropping at a faster rate. New data shows Phoenix, the one sizzling city, has dropped to number 41 among the hottest housing markets in the U.S. Tucson is ranked 37th. Rebecca Taylor, 13 News.